I would describe my art visually as figuration. How you look forward to the weekend is what I want my work to be about. I want the content of my paintings to juxtapose what the colors signify. I'm really interested in the, the colors of nightlife because it's funny, like those colors exist in nature, but when you see them at night, they look so synthetic and they trigger the idea of fun. These are all triggers for us to be like, oh, this is a fun space. There's this illusion that everyone can be an artist, right? Which they can, but it's like, you have to really take a step back and appreciate your life to even make art. Art cannot happen until you fully understand and appreciate your own life, even at the moment. I think I experience a lot of moments of doubt, but it's never when I'm making, right? So like when I make the thing, I'm very confident that I can do it. To make something and have people see it and judge it is a huge moment of vulnerability and not coming to terms with those vulnerabilities always inflect doubt. I think it's important to take moments to be like, is it great? Because to have those moments of doubt means that what you're doing is always going to be getting better. So all my works come from like my experiences or like people watching. The longer I like do it and find it or see it, it just stays in my mind like this is valuable. Like alcohol is a depressant, right? So like it goes in this like ebb and flow. So like you feel great and then like sad and then you feel great and sad. So I'm more interested in making the works that lead up to the, the fun points and the de-escalations. De everything in your life is important, but like take a step back and like try to think about what you do double takes at, right? Like what do you think about often? Cause that's the thing you should start be making things about. The things that you catch yourself thinking over and over again, or like looking over and over again, because there's something innately in all those things that are important. Like don't chase grandiose ideas because you believe that's what's important. Start personal, cause the personal can lead to the more grandiose things.